High Vibe Studios has a lot of very interesting people. And they all claim to be camera shy. Hi, hello. <laughs> I know why you're doing this. No, I was just joking. I even commented and said, I get really nervous in front of the camera, which is why I'm not in vlogs. So if you can just- Stop, you did not, I didn't see that. Yeah, I did. Prove it. I'll show you. Prove it, prove it right now. Holy mackerel. I should mention, I'm usually not in vlogs because I'm super awkward in front of the camera. I just freeze up. If you meet me in person, I'll talk your ear off. But on camera, I'm like Ricky Bobby in his first interview where he doesn't know what to do with his hands. I'm not sure what to do with my hands. Uh, it'd be good just to hold them down by okay. your side. Yeah, great. She's 100% playing modest right here because ain't nobody not want to be on camera. If they don't want to be on camera, they usually come up to me and be like, yo, can you not put me in the vlog? And I'll be like, all right. Everyone else is just lying. That's <laughs> that's not true though. You're so spontaneous and hilarious on camera, and isn't she? She's very, Everyone thinks that. Very. Everyone at the office is like, Dome is a sleeper, dude. She's funny. And you wouldn't herself. expect it. That's what I'm, I'm saying. I'm hilarious, actually. Own it. Own the hilarity. I just think when there's a camera in your face, you're like, I just- No, I'm you know what? Me. There's a Dome Marina rule. The camera has to be at least 15 oh. to 20 feet back. Because so when it's like what? right here. So like when it's right here. No, I- Be funny, funny. now. Oh. I'm hilarious. <laughs> now be funny when it's up close. Uh, <laughs> that's good stuff. Good stuff, guys. Hey, look, it's Paul. Oh, Stop talking. Part. Let's see if Matt can remember where he left his camera. He left it right here and he went to the bathroom, but I'm just going to move it a little bit down the way to right there. He moved the camera five feet. I honestly thought I just left it there. I'm just glad he's not running a prank channel. <laughs> You getting hey. hungry? Hey there, big boy. Big lens. You getting hungry? Yeah, I'm hungry. You get one. Why don't you talk about my lens? I'll talk about whatever I want about you. You have really nice knees. Oh, guy. Tanner's someone who's, for some reason, super conscious about his knees. <laughs> That's something we discovered earlier is that he doesn't own pants that don't have holes in the knees. I think that's suspicious. Hey, wait, you're wearing holy knees why are, too. Why are your knees so low? What do you mean, why are my knees Those so low? Those holes are so low. They yeah, actually are. What's, what's happening there? What do you mean, what's happening? Look, I need them high guys, and tight. Look, his knee comes out of his knee. Okay, do you stand. think I'd be able to fit in those pants? Those are the I'm tightest pants I've ever seen. Those. They're not look that at tight. His knee is. No, it's just you have tiny legs. No, I just have good looking legs. No, you have thin legs, so it doesn't look tight. You have thin legs too. No, I got those thick legs. Your pants look like they're big. No, I got thicker legs, dog, for sure. I got thicker legs. I got thicker legs. He's a thick one. Right? guys comparing legs. Who's got the thickest legs? Look at those cats. I don't know how to answer. <laughs> oh, he did. He did. He just didn't want to hurt Tanner's feelings. All right, so this is a wild video. <laughs> Next episode of The Bachelorette. Next episode of The Bachelorette. No one gets engaged. No one gets engaged. <laughs> but everyone gets... Yeah, no, what rhymes with engaged? Lage, hage, cage, mage, sage. Everyone Nobody gets, gets sage. Let's be honest, nobody watched that silly show The Bachelorette anyway. It's all scripted. Unlike Dope Enough, you should check it out. All right, guys. Hey, how's so it going? Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna all squish on this couch. All huddled together. Come sit by me. Can I sit on you? Cuddles? Uh, no, thank you. Okay. Well, I have to ask first. Consent is matters. This is gonna be awkward. Getting all of our knees in there, huh? I know how you love knees. I know you like the knees. That's how much space I have. Come on. Look at all that space you got over there. Oh, jeez. No. What the heck was that? It's always super awkward when your bit doesn't go as planned, uh, and you break something or you hurt someone. Feel really embarrassed for him. Spill, dude. He spilled. Yeah. All I see is <laughs> Tanner, dude. Yo. Oh, Tanner would have thought that was hilarious if it didn't just hit his drink. Yeah, I know exactly. <laughs> Tanner would have been all. I didn't understand what he was upset about. So you got napkins? Or? I don't know. Go find it. I'm yes. not your babysitter. Yeah. We're gonna start without you, by the way. <laughs> That's some cardboard, dude. You can't yeah. clean it up with cardboard. Hey, She's your shirt. That's what I do. Just yeah. take it off and use take it. Take it off. All right, now let me see you with it off. Sometimes I don't catch those remarks between Paul and Tanner in person, and then watching it back, I'm, I'm just like, am I oblivious? Or is there something there? All right, so this right here is a journal. I went off the grid last weekend, so I was like, I need a place to store my ideas, so I'm gonna grab my journal that I always use. Not my journal, but my like idea book that mm -hmm. I always use. And I accidentally, for some reason, grabbed one that's like a decade old, literally. Right in the front, just so you can verify, January 2010. January 2010, the reward, your life. Wait, what? <laughs> As a reward of someone oh, finding this. So we're gonna take a look at this. Um, this is gonna be rough. Some of these are lyrics, some of these are ideas. Some of it makes me look like a depressed boy. <laughs> Oh, I love that. That's my favorite part. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna try to read this one. This is some lyrics, right? Have you ever been waiting to fail? You have decided you're no good. Deep inside of you, there is something so cruel. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> this is 
<laughs> it's 10 years one. ago. This is like high school. He's already getting depressed. He's already crying. I start crying. <laughs> He's crying. Doubt is an understatement. Fear is your only friend. You can count on him to be there until the very end. That's true though. Wow. That's good. Oh, yeah. you're talking about mm. God. Or who? Maybe. <laughs> Confused and misled by the very thoughts in your head, the path seems so far to find out who you really are. You can fight it or embrace it. You can let it go or hold on. Either way, you'll end up singing this song. Oof. <laughs> it sounded like SpongeBob Campfire song. <laughs> It'll help if you just sing along. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> There's like nuggets of really good writing and then bad. Like when you're talking about doubt, I was like, dude, I'm feeling you. Like, you ended it with the word, like, you're gonna sing this song. <laughs> There's so much. It's not that I'm looking for more, just something that was there before. Oh, it's not. Oh, that. that's really good. That's, that's a good, good line. It's not that I feel empty, it's just I know there is something missing. No, that's mm -hmm. not a perfect rank. Yeah. Three out of ten. Didn't drop bars. There's nothing wrong with trying to be at life's end smiling. Ooh. Tangled up with questions about how everything will happen. Oh, there's more. Tangled up in my thoughts. I know there is no chance of untangling these knots. Like, that's, that's, not bad. that's pretty good. If they'd have changed yeah. untangling to untying, maybe. He I said they. <laughs> Hold on. He said if they would have changed untangling. Because <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we're all grilling it, you know what yeah. I'm saying? <laughs> It's what you didn't mean to do. It's what you didn't mean to say. It's what I purposely create. It's an elephant in the room. <laughs> that came out of left field. <laughs> All right, we're going to move on. Try that one's dumb. Mm, that one's a little dark. <laughs> Keep breathing. <laughs> Just going to move on. <laughs> Breathe in the sky. I'll drink the sea. Ugh. I'm leaving the night. I'm picking salt from my teeth. Oof. Sad boy. The impossible is probably- No, I'm not crying. And no, it just like takes me back to like my dark days, dude. <laughs> Circling the moon, I tear open the sky. <laughs> oh, that's like a little- <laughs> This is pretty like Greek oh, god kind of stuff. Yeah. I'm circling the moon and ripping open the sky. <laughs> Reach for the mountains and throw them up high. Yeah. That means nothing. We're stealing our moments back and you're my partner in time. That's not bad. Mm. That's pretty good. Mm. That's a good I like one. that one. See, I can like boil this all down to one song. Yeah. <laughs> Just too Just much analysis. all the good lyrics out of every oh, single one. Here we go. <laughs> Check this out. I have a page that opens and then I taped another page and then that opens too. <laughs> <laughs> this has got a flip book. So let's see what we got in here. I'd like to make up my mind once in a while without your voice changing. Ooh. I'd like some peace and quiet. There's no chance of that. Ugh. <clears throat> let's get to something that's funny. <laughs> Where's the jokes? Don't be rude. Give me something I can use. <laughs> this is kind of aggressive version of it right yeah. now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I remember this song. Happen, hopes, dreams, space, limitless, cosmology, cosmology. Oh, like I just listing words now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> breathe in ideas. This deep one's just thoughts. called breathe in ideas. The list is deep in thought and love, <laughs> love song. song. Oh, like I wrote elephant in the room again. Cat out of the bag. Cat out of the bag, Freudian slip, off the chest. Maybe I'm just <laughs> writing things that I'm like. I don't want to forget these phrases. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you say Freudian slip a lot. Jokes, He's yeah. like, heard someone say cat out of the bag today. Never forget. <laughs> Never forget. Yeah, that's going to the joke book. <laughs> Let's go in the joke. Wow. Is, it says awkward. It just says top. awkward yeah. at the top. So maybe I'm self aware at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just like, wow. <laughs> Read over the last words yesterday. Mm -hmm. Let's see if we can get to something that's maybe not a song. I had two blank pages here, but I chose to tape. I chose to tape these pages in. I probably wrote it. No, in yeah, here. I was gonna say, you're probably like in the moment. I don't got my book, but I need to write this down. That's what happened. These notes right here that fell out, as you can see on the back, that says Saugus Drugs. That's literally to confirm that was where I worked. But on these, ooh, this is oh, cringy for sure. We, we got yeah. doodles. So, <gasps> no. I didn't draw these. Look at this one. I know. Who's it from? Hannah. It's from Hannah. Who's she Hannah? worked at Saugus Drugs. <gasps> Did she have a crush on you? Yo, go get Catherine. She Catherine worked at Saugus Drugs 10 years ago with me. Go get Catherine right now. She's going to really crack up Run at these. faster. Run faster. What's his name? Tanner. Tanner <laughs> so Catherine, uh, you guys are familiar. She's been on the vlog before. I met her evidently a decade ago. Yeah. And I worked at a place called Saugus Drugs. She actually, I just hired her. She actually just left Saugus Drugs. I don't know if she's worked there for a decade. I worked there for like five years and she was on like the tail end of it. Yeah, yeah. Tattoos show you and- You misspelled tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> Tattoos. <laughs> Karen. Karen. Take a seat. Let me show you this. This is a journal that I wrote of like lyrics and like songs and ideas and things like that. If you can probably recall. <laughs> <laughs> oh Some of God. these things are from Saugus Drugs, That's all right? Awesome. So these pictures, I don't know if you knew anything about them. I bet you can figure out who drew this. Hannah. <laughs> oh, no. 
<laughs> this seemed like fun she had. Hannah's gonna watch this video and she's gonna be like, oh my gosh. Hannah at the time, I was like, what, 22 at the time? Hannah was like, just turned 16. So this was like father-daughter type situation where it was like, <laughs> she was like this hyper girl that was just like so bubbly and it was always just like, Hannah, relax. Hannah, relax. Hannah, relax. I, I love you, but relax. You know what I mean? And so she would like draw pictures in her oh free God. time. So the flowers over here are saying their own thing. It says, choose me, Super Matt, and then know me. <laughs> Didn't know oh what it God. meant then, still don't know what it means now. Hannah wasn't interesting. <laughs> So we got this one too. The Saugus Drugs, you have to sit at the front counter and just wait for customers, right? Yep. So there's a back room too, and I think she just imagined like when we weren't in vision, we were just sleeping. <laughs> Evidently, this was a time when I was in Idaho. As you could see, it says me in Idaho. <laughs> <laughs> and then a picture of her that's saying, I wish Matt was here with a sad face. Do you remember these things? It's a Saugus Drugs coupon. Those are so old. These are really, that's, this is a decade old. I love Apple. It's a picture of me, and it, in the bubble it says, I love Apple. You were the one that convinced me to get a uh, Mac. And now look at you. Make Making songs on a Mac computer. On a Mac. Yeah. On a Mac. <laughs> like it's almost like I'm responsible for Macs. <laughs> so I just thought you'd appreciate that. That is. Yeah, awesome. and then, if you want to stay for more of the cringe in this book, what you're more than it? welcome. This is like lyrics oh. and like misspellings. Yeah, and, and just like, like misspellings. Tattoos. Tattoos. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what the heck? Let's move on. Let I, I have some drawings back here. This is a screenplay <laughs> idea behind my job at Saugus Drugs. Manager is hiring and interviews good-looking girl and asks for a date. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, actually, I don't know. Max just interviewing people. Uh, so, if I hire you, will you go out with me? Oh, <laughs> right wow. on the back of it, it says webisode ideas. This is before I started YouTube. This one is a casting director, is unlike most casting directors, calls people to tell them that they don't have the part. <laughs> <laughs> Customer gets mad, wants to speak to manager. He picks up the phone and wants to speak to a higher manager. Phone tag between equal managers. Phone tag? So I think. I'm not sure. <laughs> Love your attempt at scissor. S I C Z E R. This man is successful now. By the way. <laughs> oh, look at this. Here's a bike. Remember the bike that I used to have? Oh yeah. yeah so this was like a design for a bike that I used to have that I converted like an actual pedal bike mm -hmm. into like a bike with a motor on it, and I put That's gas it. in it, and it was loud AF. You remember? It was really, really cool though. It, it was, was cool. Loud Thank AF. you. It was cool. I was cool back then, right? I was cool back then. <laughs> couldn't spell scissor, but this guy could make a bike do anything he wanted. Yeah, I was like 20 and couldn't so spell what? scissor. <laughs> This right here is an idea for a wrist strap for your phone. Because at the time, iPhones had like the dock connector and it had pins, so you could technically make a wrist strap and then yeah, just make just it so you don't drop your phone. And I was like almost about to make this, but then I was like, Apple's just gonna change it, and they did. Yikes, glad I didn't do that. I'm gonna invest everything into a wrist strap. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this, this is funny. Is this is when I was at CSUN. Oh, I call yeah. this CSUN quality list. So this is all the oh. ways that CSUN stabbed me in the back. Oh my, oh my God. God. No way. <laughs> I have like a list, oh. bro. Tuesday, February at 11.10 a.m. <laughs> Called to make counselor's appointment, but no one picked up despite stated business hours. <laughs> <laughs> you were such an oh upset person. Gosh. This was the like, bitter thing ever. Yeah. No one answered. <laughs> Write it down in his journal. All right, this is going on the list. <laughs> Did you cut your hair like an upset mom, too? Yeah, that's what I'm I was calling your like, manager. He seems like a mad soccer mom. Yeah. 16th of February at 11.20. Called info, CSUN, front desk. Person said they may come in later. Asked him why. He said he didn't know and refused to take responsibility. <laughs> <laughs> refused to take responsibility. Oh my gosh. Ever. Oh my gosh, dude. Come work at High Five Studios. <laughs> it's fun. That's probably been just doing this behind our yeah. backs. I have big lists. 11.1. <laughs> Ask Tanner and Paul to go to lunch. They weren't ready. <laughs> they weren't ready. They didn't take Told responsibility. Me wait five minutes. Wednesday, February 17th. This is the day after. 11.15. Why all at 11? It's I, all at 11, yeah. Yeah, the next one's at 11 too. 2010. What? Called to make a council appointment and was denied. Woman told me annoyed how to enroll in CTVA program and when I asked questions she huffed. <laughs> Unwilling to slow down and help me through the steps to being accepted by fall. Ironically you can't get an app without a counselor unless you're in the program. So basically I was pissed off because counselors their whole job is to help students but they were like kept swerving you. Yeah kept swerving me and I'm like I'm paying here. So that's more understandable. Yeah I respect that one. So you're writing it like as though you're writing a story though. <laughs> and she huffed every Every single word. <laughs> She's like, <gasps> No. Monday, July 19th, 11-15, 2010. Called to make a counselor's appointment, sent email to Ted about situation. Look it up. And that was it. And then I decided this is pointless. Okay, here's some more lyrics oh, for you. Man. Can't you see it's better to die on your feet than live down on your knees? Hey. 
I'm never on my knees. That, I mean, <laughs> let's just say that. Edgy, huh? You can't expect stupid people to act smart. I stand by that. I mean, I think there's so much more in here, but maybe we'll save that for another time. That's a dank meme. That's some dank memes in there, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give this a like because it's gonna let me know that I should review this again. Okay, because this was cringy. Oh gosh. I should. Yeah, yeah, I should. I've learned so much about it.